Several people hit the roads to travel. Those over at TechStar are reflecting on their accomplishments from this year and what still there is to work on. Yeah, Markeisha Jackson is joining us now with much more on this. Markeisha. Yeah, Lauren, one of the most notable projects TechStar completed this year was all that work on Southwest Parkway. In 2024, officials say they'll have the funds to tackle even more jobs. Southwest Parkway is the second most traveled road in the Wichita Falls and Wichita County area. 2023 proved to be a big year for TxDOT, especially for our crews here at home, completing several major projects in the nine counties that TxDOT Wichita Falls serves. The bridge, we did some major changes on it. We widened the structure. We fixed everything down below, brought it up to current standards. Brand new railing on this thing. No matter what direction you're traveling on this busy road, you'll notice the changes. One of them was reconfiguring the Taft Southwest Parkway intersection and also including a nice wide free right for westbound travelers on Southwest Parkway to go north on Taft. TxDOT PIO Adele Lewis says completing this project and others like the two rest areas on US 287 are because of the funding that has become available to our district. Funding that will only get better in 2024. Back in the 90s, we used to only get $20, $30 million for a whole year. Next year, 2024, we are letting almost half a billion dollars just for our district in construction, major construction only. There will be many improvements to the entire district in the years to come. We're talking about lighting. Lighting is a safety project, so putting the luminaires up around intersections, rumble strips on those rural roads. They are always open to feedback. One opinion can change a lot of things or bring our engineers to the attention of something that we need to know. Remember to drive safe this busy next week and beyond. For much more on all of the projects TechStock completed this year, just head over to our website. This is exciting yeah. to see all of this happening. Mm -hmm. It really is. Okay, Markeisha, thanks so much. Wichita Falls drivers should expect delays and lane closures while driving northbound on 287 and I-44 or Central Freeway later this week. Starting tomorrow morning at around 745, TxDOT will shut down several lanes at the Broad Street exit to just before Maureen Street. It's so a contractor can complete concrete repairs on the inside two lanes there. TxDOT asked that drivers expect delays and even asked drivers to find alternate routes. While construction is expected to wrap up on Friday, rain could delay the project and require it be rescheduled for after Christmas.